so much corrosive. Let's go back up to three, go open that. We'll go down to one on the way. We are heading to S2 because that's where Ethan is. Um, and that'll probably progress the story. But we're gonna go up to three. We are on two, yeah, we're on two. Corrosive is the other way. Let's try out our new machine. Ah, let's do that. It's just easier. And it doesn't use as much ammo. Like, I don't think we're going to be able to use that on a boss if we see one, so... We should probably use that. For this. That's sick bay. So that's... Okay, we're, we're pretty close to getting the thing we, would need, we were needing. What's around the back? Let's go around the back first. Take a look at our surroundings, huh? Jeez. This ship was huge! Yep, yep. See you sooner. God damn it! God damn it! Oh man, that was a really good one. That one was a really good one right there. That's a good job, Ghosty. That was that was pretty good. I, I don't know if you saw my eyes on that one, but there was no stopping that. <laughs> yeah, that's about the biggest you're ever gonna see my eyes. <laughs> oh boy, that was a good one. That was a great one, actually. Strong and regular. Okay, okay, okay. I see that behind us. Whoa. I'm gonna look around a little bit first. Let's see if there's anything over here. Yep. Why isn't that door opening or doing anything, in fact? <laughs> Don't even tell me it's locked or open or anything. Okay. Um, more corrosive. I think there are some stuff that we forgot to open as well. Um, boxes and stuff. Right, let me check these. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what this is. Didn't waste extra ammo. That's key. Now, can I get these? I probably will laugh very hard whenever I see that. You're right. I don't have space. Not getting hit very much, but you don't have space. All right, we got the cable. Um, that needs to go into the elevator. We need to get onto one, f the first floor as well. There's where that lockpick thing is. I'm digging this, if that's what you're talking about. I do have all the DLCs uh, installed, ready to go. So if we do get done early tonight, which, I don't know, we might. We'll see. Before I do this power cable, is that first floor? Yes. Let's climb down. Climb down and go get that corrosive. And it's. Oh, I should have checked which way it was. I think it's up to the right. My chat is major delayed for whatever reason, so. Oh god. Hang on. Bear with me. That guy saw me. Corrosive is out here and to the right. Hi. I said, at least I saw him that time. I'm gonna run. Mm -hmm. 
in here. Okay. Hell yeah, new backpack. Get more items. Why not? More corrosive. More machine gun ammo. Let's get more remote. Back to the elevator. Which is fastest ways down there, but that little guy. Let's go around. We might see the other one though. <laughs> That was as he was in my face. I don't know how that worked. Is he not dead? Okay, good. Woo! Woo! <laughs> yeah, he's fast. That thing was quick. Alright, uh, I think we can go around to the left now. Get into the animation. That's all you need. Yeah, that is accuracy through firepower. <laughs> Alright, let's put this wire in. See what happens now. No. You know. Oh, we are in. All of the lights are on. We're just going to S2. We're going straight down there. We're going. Get the story rolling, right? I think we've done enough exploring. Where's Ethan? He's waiting. I know he's waiting, lady. Little girl. Oh. Make sure I got that. I thought there was one coming up from behind. I'm running from that one. Guess we're taking him out. Thanks, Janae. You're not wrong. I'm probably not gonna say that one on stream, but you're right. I play a lot of video games though, you know? I mean, this music is getting intense. Take another, just one more. Yeah, there you go. Right there. That's where I wanted you to go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, okay. Okay, we're gonna go back down. And heal. Stun him, you know. Just use the corners, right? Okay. Kick his ass, sea bass. I had a buddy we used to call sea bass. Damn fat man. 
Yeah, those guys are not fun. Making some noises, right? Let's go over the car a little bit first. Oh, this music is just wrong button. This music is so intense. Yeah, not yet. Yeah, not yet. Oh my god, I'd love that. If I could somehow get him into like a chat here. Yeah, not yet. We ready? Let's do it. I need you to do something. Ethan. He's still alive. See the wristband? Ethan. I know, I see that. Red. <laughs> He's going to have car problems. Here we go. Hey, shh. I'm not gonna hurt you. Hell, I never would have if I could have helped you. What do you mean? I'm no killer, son. Neither is Marguerite, nor my boy Lucas. Story time. Or even Zoe here. That girl, Evelyn. She did this. What the hell is she? Now, what did she do to you? <sighs> she infected us with her gift. Man. That's what she calls it. I found her near a busted out tank in the bayou. Everything changed after that. So she infects you and then she takes control? No. Not exactly, son. She just... She forces a way into your mind, your soul, can't fight back. You are connected to her, and you can't resist the urge to. Oh, you're a, you're a different person after that. Just like Mia. So Mia sent me that message because of Evelyn. Listen, the, the girl just wants a family of her own. She's the key. Right? You find her, and you stop her. Ethan, free my family. Well, I've already killed like Please. all of them. Is that what you mean? <laughs> Evelyn, stay away from him. Why? He doesn't love you. I can make him love you. Don't. Don't hurt him. Silly, I told you I'm not going to hurt him. Don't you dare. So what? <laughs> You're not my mom. Remember? Oh, so it's just a little girl with uh, mommy and daddy issues. She didn't have any. I feel for her. You know? <sighs> See, they just grunt a lot. There's no time. You have to get out of here and find her. She's right there. Take this. What? Wait, wait, wait. what are you doing? What are you doing? Saving your life. You need to go. I won't be able to resist for much longer. No. Now go kill that little bitch. 
No. Don't no. call her a bitch, Mia. Mia! No! You know better than that. Should I put... I mean... Oh, it was a different... It was a different... Dang it. Okay, so I have her tissue sample. Okay, you little bitch. Where the fuck are you? You spelt you're wrong. I don't know, there is an O there, isn't there? Yeah, there is. <laughs> That's probably my biggest pet peeve. If you guys want to really make me mad in chat, use bad, um, wrong words. Nothing is wrong with any of that spelling. Everything is correct. Sooner, try and... Ah, man, it ain't gonna work. Red tried it earlier. What are these? Dead fish? Anybody? We having fish for dinner? Just push them around. All right. is this? Maybe some special swamp fish from uh, Louisiana. What do you say? Is that a pig? It looked like a pig. That's what I was thinking. Sea lions? Okay, speaking of fish, this is from Red, one of the moderators, one of our moderators here. Speaking of fish, sea lions who eat fish have a bacteria that live in their mouth to turn their teeth black. Interesting. And one ding from Sooner Barn. <laughs> we need the bell back. I need to get a bell. I think a bell would be a good call. Do you guys hear that? Aha. Nothing to hit you with, but I'm sure I will. Hands handgun ammo, nice, just lay in there. I think we're possibly at like the last fight here. There was a collapse, uh, one of two. So February 18th, 1892, very, very long time ago. There was a collapse in the Patterson mine. Uh, Twan and Beckford are dead, and Huxley will never uh, walk on his own again. Old man Stan was right, the ground was too uh, unstable. <laughs> February 19th, so a day later, the company's not gonna send, in any, uh, send us any replacements. They want us to work double shifts instead. <laughs> Can't wait to go back to the old country. That's the way. Corporate America. Old man Stan. Abercrombie Salt Mine. South Dolphinson. That's what they were mining. What is this? Like Thibodeau or Giroux? Are they watching us from that helicopter? What helicopter? Got a ham radio here. Oh, shoot. We have a chance to get the Magnum again. <laughs> Hell yeah, let's grab that. I've taken Mia's things. I was hoping that was going to be the case, too. We're going to get it right now. We're getting the Magnum. Our main damage here, as I'd imagine. Accuracy through firepower on the machine gun, I'm thinking. Pick up the ham radio, right? Oh wait, psycho stimulants? Pop them as we run after this. Alpha One, this is Bravo One, do you read? This is Alpha One, report, did you find anything? A thorough search of the Baker property revealed zero survivors. Repeat, zero survivors, we no, did we... find evidence of a skirmish. Yeah. Evelyn? Negative. However, we did find several encrypted messages from the Baker's son, Lucas, to an unknown third party. You can probably guess who that was. That's just great. We've had reports using the abandoned mine south of the property. I'm gonna go have a look. Roger that. We'll meet you at those coordinates. If you encounter Evelyn, orders are shoot to kill. Repeat, shoot to kill. They're coming after Evelyn. Yeah, they're. I think they're talking about me. Oh, look at that. How do I miss all these things, you know? 
what is right outside there? Just realized I was on enhanced round. I'm glad I looked at that. Okay. Hey, Sharky Boy! That is very loud. Very loud. I'm gonna need to work on that. That is supremely loud. We got another Magnum shot. That's key. Sharky, what's up, dude? We are about to finish this, I believe. Burner fuel. I don't even need that. I believe we're going into the mines. Thank you for joining us. Reload the Magnum. I'm on it. I'm on it. I'm on it. I beat it. It's pretty, pretty creepy. Yeah, dude. It is. It is supremely creepy for sure. So I should have had those uh, remote mines out. I'd say. Damn it! I want to try for a quick swap. Hot swap. Hot swap. Yeah. Yeah. Bat tat tat. Nah, I didn't want to waste all this. There's a lot of it, but I. Seriously, I don't. I don't know. I think we're gonna be. Just fine. We ain't gonna use him on the boss, I know that. I don't I don't know that. <laughs> I think that. Hey guys! Thanks for thanks for getting together. I totally knew that one on the left was there, I swear. those shotgun shells right now. I don't even want to know. I have nothing I can do with these, though. This is a problem. I have no other mixing things. Okay. Pretty sus. The abandoned mine still has power. Yes. Yes, it is. Oh, I gotta go around the other side, I guess. No. What? Why can't I get in here? Closed on me. All right, let's go down to the mine. Yeah, the old wife this time. Yeah, we might run through it again. Yeah, definite, definite possibility. I've seen some speed runs that people can get through this in like an hour and a half. There was one at GDQ that somebody got through it in literally an hour and a half the entire game. Yeah, that's a good question. Who did you choose, Sark? In the old salt mine? Isn't that what they said this is? It's a little salty. Just a little salty down here. Salty place. Super salty. Oh, I see it. Oh my god, I almost just ran through that. Yes, I agree. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate that a lot. <clears throat> you dummy! You big dummy! You see him? He is so dumb. That got him. 
They're so dumb. So dumb. Why not? Go ahead and take this off. It's getting worried that we're getting pretty close. <sighs> oh, I can leave it on, but not equipped. Okay, that's cool. I think we're getting. We gotta have close to a full mag now, right? I see the shadow behind me. <laughs> Gonna need you to die right now. <gasps> Don't kill me. Will you just die? Thank you. Oh my god. Okay. Oh man. Let's use uh, our little ones. Woo! That was that one was pretty pretty nuts. I didn't see him at first. Wow. Wow. Alright, we're green now, that's good. Reload this guy. Put 64 of them back in that magazine. It's like Mustafa. Come on, dude. You have no limbs. Just, just die. There. What was that? A little, little, little death gargle? Is that what I heard there? straight. Let's check this. This is blocked off, so let's check this. We check straight. There wasn't much there. Um, yeah, we, we can't get the um, reload speed now is what we can't get. I bet that reload speed was pretty nice though, honestly. This clears up an inventory space, right? Eyes open, Fanny. You're right. You're right. Lucas is, must have been here, huh? Can I just equip this? No. I feel like I searched every nook and cranny for that shit. <laughs> Yeah, the old twice twice I just got, man. That's, uh, a go uh, you know that term, don't you, Sharky? The old twice twice? If it, ever, if it happens again, I'm in trouble. Okay. This might be a long story time, folks. 
Twice, twice is so brutal, yeah, it is. Sent Friday, January 16th, 2015, 12.42 a.m. It's like me, a little night owl. Uh, thanks to you guys, it's been about a week since my head, uh, head's been clear and back to normal, and she still thinks she's got me. Uh, you guys really need to work on fixing that. Not only does it, uh, she look like a little kid, but she's about as stupid as one, too. Uh, second one. Mom and Dad are f still totally under, though. I was wondering, is this whole family obsession something you guys programmed into her? It's kind of fucked up. This sounds like it is, Lucas. That bitch Mia is somewhere in between Evie La La Land and reality. She gets pretty violent, so I locked her up in a cell. It is. I thought maybe Evelyn would get mad since Mia's her favorite and all, but she doesn't seem to care. She actually goes and visits her sometimes. She thinks Mia's her mommy. Like I said, your bioweapon is fucked up. Evelyn's family obsession is getting out of hand. She makes everyone kidnap more and more assholes off the street to add to her little freak show of a family. Maybe she's getting tired of Mia not coming around, but it's a pain in the ass for me because I gotta clean up the mess whenever somebody new comes along. By the way, Evie's looking sick or something. Her skin is getting all wrinkly and she's getting gray hairs. Is that supposed to happen? It's almost like she's getting old all of a sudden. My theory now seems to be more possibly correct than I thought. I was joking, really, like Evie is grandma, but that grandma's got something to do with it. Kick it. Infection report. This report details the symptoms that appear when the bacterium that grows inside the E-Series infects a human. Be sure to read this document thoroughly before dealing with the E-Series weaponized assets, herefore re referred to as mold. Hereafter. Initial infection. The mold uh, ingests nutrients from the subject's body to propagate itself and slowly takes, after, or takes over cells within the body. As a side effect of this, the infected subject gains remarkable regenerative abilities. During experiments, we removed arms and legs from test subjects and found that they were able to uh, co-apt the amputated limbs in a matter of minutes. That's ironic, because that happened to Ethan. Ethan had his hand cut off, but now you see him with his left hand. Is, is Ethan made of mold? Once the mold reached his, reaches the brain, the subject's thoughts become in tune with those in the E-Series asset. The subject starts to hear things and experience hallucin uh, hallucinations. It soon comes under complete control of the E-Series asset. If this state continues, the host will lose all sense of ego. Complete infection. After every cell in the body has, taken over by, has been taken over by the mold, the subject begins to lose their human form. Physical mutations differ from case to case, but all result in him or her acquiring incredible physical strength. Containing a subject at this stage would be extremely difficult, which is essentially Mia. Let's with that in a second. Let's see what we got here. E necrotoxin E series dosage test. Ten minutes after dose death. Twelve minutes after dose cell calcification. Five minutes after dose vomiting. That's that. So, what do we got here? Target acquired. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's read this first. Research report. Oh my god, a seven pager. Okay. <clears throat> Let me. <clears throat> I'm a little parched. Let me just, let me just try something. Okay, this project was inst uh, instigated, weird choice of words, instigated in 2000 as one of uh, several concepts for the company's next boss, uh, next, generated ex next generation experimental battlefield superiority initiative. Working with, this is going to sum up everything, working with technical assistance from HCF to develop a bioweapon for neutralizing combatants en masse with minimal direct contact. Next boss was uh, later folded and all of its assets diverted to this project. What makes this project markedly different from conventional weapons is its ability to turn enemy combatants into allies, converting hostile elements into willing servants. 
since this effectively eliminates the cost of not only POW handling, uh, but also combat itself, it's no wonder we had the blank and even blanks blank organization chomping at the bit to get on board. The project would, so it's um, a redacted statement, it's, it's uh, classified information. The project would have never existed were it not for the discovery in blank of blank. You know, ironically, is Lord Magnus here by chance? Anybody know? He could probably speak more. I didn't play six, but this took place three years after six. And I bet whatever in blank is wherever they were. It was like an island place. Uh, Shiva was the main girl. She was kind of a badass, but uh, anyway, the remarkably, er, re remarkably progressed very uh, vicariant evolution fungus that we commonly term the uh, mutamycete. Yes, the mutamycete was the the bad thing in the last game. That was uh, it. Actually, was causing these things were forming down in some island nation, and we had to go down there and take them out. But the uh, the fabrication method for each bioweapon was to introduce the uh, mutamycete genome to a pre-stage four human embryo and perform cultivation in a controlled environment over a period of 38 to 40 weeks. The resultant organisms uh, were, <laughs> many, were referred to as candidate specimens and graded based on usability from the impractical and faulty series A through D to the perfected E series. I wonder if A through D were like um, Alice. Uh, Alice, oh my god, it was. Oh my god, it was. Alice was the first one, I think, in the first Resident Evil. Uh, I don't remember. Alice was in the movies, but anyway. Yeah, anyway. I don't really know that. A common appearance was selected for the bioweapons that a roughly 10-year-old girl to ensure ease of blending in with urban slash refugee populations. The first E-series... Something like that, anyway. Okay, the first E-series specimen named Evelyn has proven capable of secreting the mutamycete blank from her tissue at well at will. It is also of note that Evelyn's mutamycete uh, imposes a profound control over body and control when introduced into a host organism. We still have a lot to learn about the mechanism in which Evelyn achieves and maintains this control, but the working theory is that the vector is sim similar to the autoinducer pheromones used for Forum sensing in pseudo pseudomonas bacteria, pseudomonas. What any of that means? Evelyn's control is exerted in a series of discrete stages. Um, the first of which is hallucination. Almost immediately after infection, the start uh, subject begins to see images of Evelyn, though she is not in fact there, and even hear her voice, which is inaudible to anyone else. Auditions uh, with infected subjects throughout the stages of infection reveal that, at first, the phantom Ellie appears to be a normal young girl, sometimes desiring companionship or assistance. As some time progresses, she begins making more and more extreme demands, including self-mutilation and attacks on other people. The fizzy, uh, psycho psychological shock, sorry, that induces help, uh, that this induces, helps to break down the mind's natural barriers to Evelyn's brainwashing effect. And by the time mental control is achieved, the mutamycete infection has progressed throughout the body cells. So the body does something. Did we read this one? Oh my god, we didn't read this one, did we? Evelyn's functions also include the ability to form... We have to be close to done with these. This is probably the last one. The ability to form organisms through mycelia, uh, the fungal filaments, the little dangly things. The term organism is used uh, loosely here. Strictly speaking, these are super, super organisms. <laughs> super organisms formed of countless mycelia. What's important, though, is that they inf uh, exhibit a strong survival instinct and will defend themselves fero uh, ferociously with the slightest provocation, uh, provocation. Their fungal toughness and remarkable strength give them significant battlefield potential. The researchers have called these superorganisms the molded, made of mold, and also molded as in shaped. Uh, the name has a certain elegance to it. For the treatment of accidental infections, performing blank on samples of Evelyn's body tissue produces a unique fungicidal serum. Uh, administering the serum to an infected... Remember, we have samples of her tissue. Um, administering the serum to an infected uh, subject will cause the mycelia to calcify, 
but if the subject's cells are already largely invaded, the serum will be fatal. Since the treatment window is so small, the serum's primary use is, a, is therefore a disposal of infected subjects rather than a cure. In exploring the serum's potential, we found that subjecting it to blank would enhance its effect to extreme potency, becoming a compound we now call e-neurotoxin, which blank blanks even an even tiny amount. What's been interesting to observe in Evelyn's behavior is her obsession with the concept of family. In experiments we found on multiple occasions, their infected subjects were compelled to act as mother or father, treating her as if she were really their daughter. Why did she settle upon family as a theme for her mental control? This is just speculation, but it could be that she instinctively understands that a family unit is better suited to blending into social groups than a lone girl. On the other hand, well, a sentimental sort might suggest that she's uh, making up for a perceived lack of love in her quarantine upbringing, a parent's love. Yeah, I mean, she was obviously had tests run on her forever. Okay. Uh, and I think we're at a save room, which this might be our final freaking save room. Play rounds, and what are those? I think we're good, y'all. I think we need to save. Look at that shadow. Ethan's ready. Okay. We're doing it. I'm pretty nervous now that there's uh, pressure on the line here. Is it this way? Yeah, it's this way. Why is it locked? Oh, I don't think I actually ever interact with this thing. That's where that goes. Okay. Okay. So we're putting the tissue samples in there. It's killing the old sample, and now we have a neurotoxin. So I'm gonna go. I think. I think I know what we're gonna do with this. You got this, Fanny. I think I know what we're gonna do with that neurotoxin. Now this is open. You little bitch. <laughs> I don't mean that. I don't mean that. She's just misunderstood, you know? Why not? I'm spooked. I'm spooked. Nani? That's right. I need to change that. Is, is dead or something like that? That her, her lamb is dead? What's up, Ghosty? Thank you, sir. Those things are so loud right now, by the way. Okay, alright, what's going on? What's going on? Fuck! I knew I should have had this out. guys. Thanks for playing. Better luck next year. Better luck next year. That's ironically the same thing we tell Cubs fans usually whenever they get knocked out of the playoffs. That was good timing. Next. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm healing. 
We're gonna use both of these because uh, we'll use one of them now while we see more enemies. Plus 19. Which way are we going? That way or this way? Um, this is just a little loop around it looks like. The music is fucking awesome. Baseball. He's back in the green, it looks like. Let me check that again. Yeah, he's in the green. Okay. Waste this on you. Gosh dang it. He he didn't stand much of a chance. He did. Dang it. Does that count? Did we make it to the boss? No big deal. No big deal. All this burner fuel that I really didn't need because I don't even have my flamethrower on me. He looked at his buddy and said, damn! Yeah. Going hard still, Fanny. Yeah. We're, this is the, yes. Yes, I am, champ. This, that was pretty good, wasn't it? This is the, uh, that's my Fortnite uh, pump action skill right there. Never played that game, but. We are actually at the final boss area. We are about to go into the final boss fight, I believe. We believe. Get ready for some madness. It's gonna be two at once, isn't it? Of course it is. I'm running past him, I think, boys. Bye, guys. No? Okay, that ain't gonna work. Yikes. Get off of me. Oh, shit. How do you miss a Magnum shot? How do you miss a Magnum? Saving the rest of those. Got one of them, I heard him explode. Oh, man. Get off of me, buddy. Oh, I'm like completely stuck here. This is not good. Thought that might hit them both, but I don't know. I guess it didn't.
Didn't think I was gonna get it. God dang it. Let me over here. Say bye to your head, okay? We don't, who needs a head? <sighs> okay. I've gotten a good amount of them, Sharky, but I don't think I have them all. I've gotten a good amount, but I definitely did not get all of them at all. Ghosty, please stick around. Don't worry. It's okay. Now you got me looking, though, because this is like the last area where you would possibly see one. My bet is that we see one. Okay, so we're going to sneak through there. Okay, let's go. This might be it. Who knows? Giving me maps. Keep an eye out for virus samples and breaching charges too. <laughs> of course. That was a lot of uh, ammo for this. That's good. I'm getting nervous. I don't think I. This will be my first game that we've ever beaten on stream. I'm very excited about that. Thank you all for joining me for it. We do have the DLCs, so Sharky, if you want to see something, why would there be a wheelchair there? And she's not in it. I told you, man, I think, I really think Evelyn is that little girl, or somehow granny. There's the doll we saw earlier, like a long time ago. Janae, you think so? I'm, I'm, I'm convinced. I hear a bobblehead now. Yo, I swear I heard a bobblehead that time. Aha! Yeah, there we go. I'm sure of it. Oh, it's not here. It's gone. It's gone. The door is here. E O O one. Now, oh, aha. Now it all makes sense. I think Granny is Evelyn. Yeah, this this picture kind of shows it. One of the few I actually found that one. Yeah, uh, so this and this are the same. This is a label for Granny, E-001. Granny is E-001. It's just in your face, Janae. <laughs> Or she was the first in a in a series. I mean, yeah, yeah, I think so. I think I think she would would have been the first, but um, I think that's her code name is what that is. Holy shit, we're back in the old house. Yo, while we're here, where's that fireplace? Shh, stay there, Evelyn. <laughs> Yo, where, where's that fireplace? Ah! <laughs> it's your fault. Why am I seeing this? Holy shit, she did move. That was creepy as hell. No way, I'm at the end. I want to go. I gotta go, Janae. Taking my eyes off the ghost, is that a good idea or bad? <laughs> Is 
Ryan. It's okay. It's okay. It's me. I know you didn't mean to. Where is that fireplace? Show him, Mommy. But like you shouldn't have done that! It fucking hurts! Does it want to be my daddy? Then he can die. Now it's mommy's turn to kill you. God, this little girl is so fucked up. Just checking it out. <laughs> For old times' sakes. Hey. You're gonna be one of us. And then maybe you'll play nicely. Maybe he's not. I'm not playing. No! Get that away from me! Forget about me! Holy shit! I can die in this? Oh, this doll, though! Oh my god, this doll just fucking terrified open me. open that. Put one right between our eyes. Let's go upstairs. To the attic, maybe? Ah! Shit! Quit it! <laughs> Stay away! No, no, don't! Stay back! No, no! Take your medicine! It's grape flavored. You. Told ya. Told ya. Why does everyone hate me? Just in fact, I think right there she just in fact. I think we're here. I think we're here, folks. Y'all ready? Alright, I'm straight machine gunning this time. Maybe I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to heal. Cannot heal. Cannot heal. Cannot block. Oh yes I can. This is new. This is new. 
That's very new. Whatever that is. Can I just heal? Use it. That sounded like Chris. I won't lie, that definitely sounded like Chris Redfield. Play time for Looks good. I think we've done it. Redfield. I think that's it. Yeah, just turning quite into a lot of crystals. I think we're done, folks. Everybody, breathe a little sigh of relief. I got some achievement over here. I don't know what that was. There's not a bug in front of the camera. Get out of here. Hell yeah. Thank you guys. This has been an experiment to see if it worked. I'm getting a ton of achievements, I guess. Look at all the different grenades he's got. I guarantee this is Chris. I'm Redfield. Yep. I'm glad we found you. <sighs> the fuck took you guys so long? Ethan? Hey. Mia. You made it. What kind of chem fluid I'm is glad. that? Did I? Strong chem fluid. Dude, that garage fight, I had no idea. I missed the key. They say that when one door closes, another opens. Yeah. Well, a door closed tonight. And what a long night it was. But not just for me. Me and I weren't the only victims here. So were the Bakers. It was that True. thing, Evelyn, who made them that way. Now I knew it. I told you they'd be Evelyn's in it. Evelyn's dead. Yeah, obviously. Chris was there. And these guys are here to clean up the mess. I had just come to terms are with Are they, losing though? Her. Who knows? But now she's back and wants to start over. Put all this behind us. Maybe this is where the next door opens. Yeah, Resident Evil 8. I already bought the DLCs sooner. They're all installed. I'm gonna need a, a good cliffhanger. Go tell and roll. Will somebody go tell her already? Go. Aunt Rody. Those aren't the original lyrics. I have them right here. Go tell Aunt Rody that the old gray goose is dead. The one she's been saving to make a feather bed. The old gander's weeping because. Hang on, I'm gonna let them sing. A prisoner with no parole. They locked me up and took my soul. It's a pretty cool song. Thank you. Thank you, Red. Thank you all for being here through it. It's been awesome to have, like, people hanging out with me, talking to me while I play a game, like supporting the channel as well. 
You guys are awesome. It's a pretty cool cutscene. So, let me go through those that poem. I believe it's like a pretty famous. Oh, from philosopher Rousseau, they say. Um, tell tell Aunt Rhody that the old gray goose is dead, the one she's been saving to make a feather bed. The old gander's weeping because his wife is dead. The goslings are mourning because their mother's dead. She died in the mill pond from standing on her head. Go tell Aunt Rhody that the old gray goose is dead. That was a cool game.